Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I want to go over the Chimera Kim's blends that they have on their website. If you haven't taken a look at those, they have a great selection of blends already made up. So, how do you guys like this shirt? I just got it made up. It's on my store. If you guys are wanting one of these shirts, um, I have them priced super low right now. They're available both if you go in the video, like right above the video description there. Um, and also if you go over to my website, deadbud2.fit, they're available there. So, I just thought it was kind of funny. I heard somebody say something along those lines, and I was like, I need to put that on a shirt. Anyway, so let's hop on over to Khmer Kim's. All right, so they have a whole bunch of blends here, whether it's SARMs or peptides or a combination of the two. One of my favorites that I use a lot is the BPC TB500 blend. I have it right here. I use this almost every single day. I absolutely love BPC-157 and TB-500. Uh, putting them together is a phenomenal blend for healing stuff up. They have a bunch of other stuff here. If you like, let's say, AOD combinations or tesofensine combinations. Uh, CJC-1295 with DAC and Ipamorlin. That's a great one. I've used that myself in the past success. Some of these they have as separate um, uh, vials or bottles, whatever. And sometimes it's blended together all in one, which is really nice to have as well. Something like this blended all in one is my favorite way to go with things, but sometimes you wanna stack a couple of things and have different dosages, or maybe you wanna use one every day and one every couple of days or something along those lines. So having that option is nice as well. Here's a blend that I think I've actually looked at yet. So let's check this one out. You can see they have capsules and liquid available for it. This one is Carterine S23 and YK11. So no, I don't think I've actually looked at this one yet. This is pretty cool. Uh, for those of you who like S23, it's an extremely potent muscle builder, right? YK11, same thing, extremely potent muscle builder, probably more so than S23 in my opinion. Um, they're dosed pretty doggone well. You also have the Carterine in there with it. So you're going to have the cardio increase from the Carterine. And then you're going to have a very, you're going to have a very potent combination here of S23 and YK11 both building muscle and providing a lean look. So the combination of S23 and YK11 is probably the most potent thing you could actually combine as far as SARMs go. Those are the two most potent SARMs. Um, and they both give that lean, dry, hard look. And combining it with Carterine is actually pretty fantastic. Let's look at this one here. They have LGD4033 and YK11 blended. This is an injectable. This one is actually out of stock. So apparently it's selling pretty good. Each mill has 50 milligrams of LGD4033 and 50 milligrams of YK11. So this is something if you want to grow like a freaking weed, <laughs> this would definitely do it. It's probably why it's out of stock. So that's a great price. That's a huge amount you're getting per vial. There's 10 mils. So you're getting 500 milligrams of LGD4033 and 500 milligrams of YK11 in every single one of those vials. That's a huge amount. That's probably, I don't know, that's a lot. They also have a whole bunch of other stuff like the aminos, peptides, nootropics. So when you go to the aminos, they have a whole bunch of these here. They're blends. So this Centaur has, uh, it's a recovery blend. It has all these aminos in it. So if you want an injectable recovery blend, that's a phenomenal option. That's similar actually to what I have for this Warhorse supplement. I think I've showed you guys this in a couple of videos. This is a product I designed. It's built around an amino acid profile. So L-leucine is the primary amino acid that your body needs to build muscle. And so this has a big dose of L-leucine in it, but your body also needs the other essential amino acids in order to fully digest and absorb the L-leucine. So I've got all of those in there in proper ratios to maximize how much amino acid, specifically leucine you're getting, that's actually bioavailable. I've also included some creatine, some glutamine, some vitamins, prebiotics, probiotics, a little bit of dextrose in MCT powder. That's going to spike insulin levels and help drive all these nutrients into your muscle. The MCT powder is going to assist the dextrose. So you get a spike of insulin, but it's also going to be sustained for a little bit longer. So it's not going to digest as fast. And so instead of just getting a quick rapid spike in insulin levels, it's going to increase insulin levels for a while during your workout. The idea is one serving is three scoops. So you'd mix this into your shaker cup and then start sipping it about half an hour before you go to the gym, sip on it during the workout and then finish it right after your workout. So that way your body's getting a huge amount of amino acids with its creatine, some dextrose in there. It's like the optimal blend for building muscle very quickly in a natural way. So if you're gonna be using any kind of SARMs or steroids or whatever else, make sure you're taking a good supplement. If you don't wanna take mine, that's fine. If you use uh, code if you use code DADBOD, you can save 10% and get free shipping on this product over on 
warhorsetotalfitness.com. This is an excellent product for building muscle in, of, in and of itself. I mean, even if you're not taking anything, this is going to significantly help with building muscle. I had one guy ask me if it was steroids because he's like, man, this stuff is great. I feel amazing, which is pretty cool. Anyway, if you are taking any kind of PED, you need to be feeding your muscles. And a lot of guys don't do that correctly, myself included. There have been a lot of times when I've been taking stuff and I just don't feel like eating or whatever. And so I've neglected my nutrition. Something like this can very, very much help. So consider taking this, please. It helps me out. It's a phenomenal product. In my opinion, it's the best on the market. I designed it myself and I hope you guys enjoy it. So back over here, they have the Hercules blend. Let's check this one out. So this is another combination of some amino acids. You got some NAC in there as well. Glutamine, carnitine, arginine, and then there's manticore. This is a combination of arginine and carnitine. Now, I did take a product very much like this. I haven't taken this specific one, but I did take an injectable that was the exact same blend and it works really, really good for increasing a pump. If you don't mind giving yourself a little stick before the gym, uh, the one I used was from, I think it was Pure Raws. No, maybe it was somebody else. Anyway, you know, burned a little bit on injecting. I would do a sub-Q injection in my stomach uh, before working out and just do a half mil. I don't know if this one would burn or not. Hopefully not, because I know that they're pretty good on their product quality. But the amount of pump that I got from it was just insane. It was like a really, really good pre-workout pump but without the pre-workout stimulation or feeling just just purely the pump phenomenal let's check out this it's choline acetyl l-carnitine and l carnos so like i said they have a huge selection of different blends especially on the aminos so hope you guys like that re website review hopefully i've earned your subscription today i appreciate all of you watching me over the years Hopefully we have more years of great content ahead. Hopefully we get a new administration so that things loosen up on the industry a little bit and I don't have to worry about it getting shut down completely. Hope you guys are having a great week. Thank you for watching again. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.